it is box opening time. I had another baby that arrived today. So I'm going to start right away. Um, all I did was open the box as usual so that no names were given away. Um, and this is what the box looked like when I opened it. She appears to be in a bag. Alrighty, I'm just gonna move the box. And get the bag open. So it was done with a bow in this cute um, cupcake bag. Hard for me. So this baby was made by um, Shannon Harden of the Night Owl Nursery. Um, I purchased her through Reborns.com, but I since then have found the artist's page on Facebook. So, um, I will put both links in the description of this video, so you may find her if you like her work. She was sent with this lovey. Um, so this is her COA and paperwork. I'm going to wait to show that until the end. I love how everything is wrapped. The presentation of this box opening is gorgeous. Millie Moon Diapers. I don't think I've heard of that brand before. Um, very gorgeous though. I love the print. Here's her pacifier. B to me. This was in her photos. I love the mint color. It goes with my nursery theme. Um, this baby is a girl. So here's one of the outfits that was in her photos. Um, and a little octopus dress. Uh, Kate Quinn. Kate Quinn octopus dress. I love the sleeves on this. Um, and it's got a little matching headband. I love this set. It's gorgeous. I have not seen before. So she spent uh, this gorgeous FAO headband. Very pretty. Uh, little baby leggings. Oh, I love this dress. This is gorgeous. Very gorgeous. That'll look gorgeous on her. Uh, size three months, and this is Babies R Us. Gorgeous. A really nice material, too. So 
I think that's it. Let me pull out the baby. Let me adjust everything here. I'm going to get started. I'm sorry if I seem like I'm going through this a little quickly. I only have so much space on my phone, so I'm trying to get it all done in a few minutes. <laughs> Easier said than done. Gorgeous presentation, um, Shannon. I love what you've done so far. And I cannot wait to see the baby. Oh, I love the sleeper. Very pretty. Brits bees. I recognize the little bee on the feet. <laughs> oh, and excellent. She's got a diaper on, so I can just pull that off without worrying about showing you too much. And she's got a onesie on underneath, so perfect. I can just take this right off. Oh, she feels so nice. Oh, her nails look beautiful. Adorable pads of the feet. I love her skin color. The veining looks really nice. She smells so good. I will um, take the phone off the tripod at the end, too, to show you up close. Bottom of the feet look good. I love how she did the um, shading. The nails look good. Little baby wrist. Beautiful. Gorgeous. You did a good job, Shannon. She's gorgeous. Alrighty. I think I'm ready to do the head. So, on the count of three. One. Two. Three. Here's the pretty princess. Oh my goodness, she's gorgeous. And I, for those of you that um, know my babies and know my channel. I love the white blonde hair color. And I think, oh wow, she's so gorgeous. I love how she did the, um, eyelashes in the platinum color as well. I think that's so unique. Um, I've been wanting a Rosalie kit for a while, but I've been kind of waiting to see the right one. And, I mean, this one just hit me. I knew that this was the baby and the Rosalie that I had been waiting for. Let me take her off the tripod. Bear with me, guys. Sorry. So there's she is, Miss Rosalie. Here's her face up close. see the swirling, beautiful painted hair. She's got a beautiful swirl. Here's her fist. And a little bit of load. Show you her nails. Here's her nails. Beautiful. So, for those of you guys who don't know, this is the Rosalie kit by Olga Ayer. Um, I have a, I have another kit by her. I just think that sculptor is does a really good job. 
and I have decided on a name for this little princess. I decided to name her after one of my favorite seasons of American Horror Story. Uh, most people like the witch season, but my favorite was actually the freak show. So, um, this sweet little girl is named Elsa, after Elsa Mars. So what I did, because I, I wanted to um, try to keep the name Mars in it, so I've decided to name her Elsa Mars Nerida. Um, just because I don't think it would be American Horror Story if it didn't um, keep the Mars bit, which I do love um, how they use that in the show. And I thought with her blonde hair, um, she would make a perfect Elsa. I love this little pouty lip. Oh my goodness. She looks like she's, like, in the middle of a sweet dream. Let me, um bring out her paperwork let me show you guys that i'm doing pretty good time wise again i'm so sorry if this seems rushed oh my goodness she's so gorgeous shannon you did a great job um she's so pretty there we go Get the envelope open so here is some of her photos that I fell in love with on Reborns.com from the Night Owl Nursery. This is definitely a nice keepsake. Thank you for this, Shannon. Um, Night Owl Nursery Certificate of Rebirth. May 13th, 2021, 4 pounds, 3 ounces, and 19 inches long. Here are care instructions. And here is her COA. So that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to definitely make sure to bring this girl on my channel often. Um, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your Monday. Thank you guys so much. And thank you, Shannon. She is so gorgeous. Um, she's just so gorgeous. Um, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Bye, guys. Until the next one.